Time for Daily Joe. Fun stuff we find uh, buzzing around the internet uh, this morning. We start you off with this one. It's a well known fact that the world's giraffes uh, collectively possess thousands of neckties. They just don't know how to wear them. <laughs> sure. So yeah. now. They get via, one for Father's Day every year. Yeah, yeah. Via Twitter, this is breaking the internet. If a giraffe were to wear a necktie, would he wear it at the top of his neck or at the bottom of his neck? I would say the bottom of his neck, Marianne. Well, that's, that's where I wear mine. Funny, but the internet does not agree. In fact, actually, the internet is kind of split. Comedian Jerry Hammond posted this question on Twitter uh, a couple of days ago, uh, and uh, and people have said, well, clearly the giraffe on the left is work giraffe. Uh, giraffe on the right is going out for drinks after work giraffe. <laughs> <laughs> For instance, other ones like uh, giraffe on the left is nerd, uh, giraffe on the uh, right is how my dad wears his tie. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I'm going to say, and when somebody else said, who wears their their uh, their necktie like right under their chin like that? Of course, yeah. it's on the one on the right. I say the one on the on the left. Really? What do you think? I think it's one on the right. You think it's one on the right? Yeah, because my necktie is down low, <laughs> the base of my neck, not the very top. <laughs> Well, if you want to check it out, uh, again, this comedian's name is Jerry Hammond. Uh, he's verified on Twitter, and you can weigh in on his, uh, okay, on his things. All right. Uh, Spotify users, that music service is calling you out. If you use Spotify to play Sorry 42 times on Valentine's Day, or were one of the 3,749 people who streamed It's the End of the World as We Know It <laughs> because of the Brexit vote, they are calling you out. You're gonna, you could end up being part of this new advertising campaign on billboards around the world. They're here in the U.S., also in England, France, and Germany, revealing some of the weird, wonderful <laughs> habits of Spotify users. I love this. Now, they're not naming names, no, but, but... You know who you, you are. You know who you, you are. Know who you, you know are. who you are. <laughs> Some of the playlists people have put together, it's pretty funny. The this ad campaign hilarious. was created by the company's marketing team uh, and it sports the tagline, thanks 2016, it's been weird. <laughs> it has been weird. It's been weird. You recognize yourself. All right, last but not least, funny. just when you think photographers can't humiliate cats any further, take a look at what a Japanese <laughs> photographer has done. He has put his three Scottish fold cats uh, in an adorable <laughs> series that features them begrudgingly sporting caps knitted from their very own fur. Ew. Right? <laughs> Ah, oh, look at oh, oh. Oh, nice. So he collects the shed fur that we have. We all have all of our couches, oh, those of us who have cats, wow. and then forms up the um, into tiny hats into any shape he wants, including one you saw there of the a certain president elect wow. who shall remain nameless here. Uh, that is hilarious. This morning. And look how much the cats love it. They love it. They're so excited. Look, like I just got rid of this. <laughs> You're putting it back on me. Oh, that is so horrible. <laughs> that wraps up your daily show. <laughs> That's good oh stuff. Oh, my gosh. Poor kitties. Yeah. I guarantee you those cats are destroying something that that man loves right now. Hope so. All right, right see how traffic's looking at.